Walking in heels. It's something that can strike fear into the heart of any woman, whether she's going out in Las Vegas or competing in a pageant. Crystal, how do I walk in those massive six inch platform heels? Well, personally, I had a bit of an unfair advantage because my mom put me into dance classes at a young age. So since taking ballet, I've strengthened the lower half of my body, my calves, my ankles, the muscles in my feet, and I find walking in heels not that bad. You don't have to be a dancer to know what I know. This video contains the top three exercises that will strengthen your legs to make walking in heels a walk in the park. Keep watching. Number one, get used to doing calf raises. These exercises can be done at the gym, you can take the staircase, or you can stand anywhere that is elevated from the ground. You wanna do about 100 of these a day. So that's four sets of 25. And the whole idea is really just to strengthen your calf muscles. Not only will they look better when you're in swimsuit, having that tone, but your legs also become stronger and you're able to handle the extra weight of a platform. The biggest secret about walking in high heels is that you just have to be walking on the balls of your feet most of the time. Anybody who puts their weight in their heel has to know what they're doing. Otherwise, it becomes a recipe for disaster and you can easily fall or roll your ankle. So walking in heels really is all about having your weight in the balls of your feet. Which leads me to my second tip. Do plenty of releves and elevés on flat ground. An elevé is when you go onto your tippy toes without bending your knees, like this. A releve is when you bend your knees, which is called a plie in ballet, and go all the way up to your tippy toes, like this. Do as many of those as possible. Do them in the shower. You can do them when you're waiting for the bus. The idea is just to strengthen your lower legs to be able to handle anything. Tip number three is to strengthen your arches. If you look at pinup girls, Betty Boop, traditionally feminine silhouettes, you will notice that the woman's feet are always pointed. The arches are always pushed down. That's because it lengthens your legs. It makes your legs look really long. Most people are born with a certain flexibility at the top of their foot. If you have high arches, it means that your foot can point more. If you're born with lower arches, it usually means you're more flat-footed. Especially if you're young, it's easier to do certain stretches to improve your arch and make it easier for your foot to point. I would improve my arches as a child by sticking my feet under a piano and then straightening my knees. That would make the muscles on top of my foot really stretch. Now I just point my toes and arch my foot out of habit. And that's why I find heels not too scary because my foot is just perpetually in that position anyway. Working on arches is an easy way to get your body used to what it feels like when you're gonna be in heels for a long time. Quick recap, to improve walking in heels, start with your calf raises, do your elevés and relevés, and stretch your arches to make walking in heels second nature. It's all about strengthening your feet and getting yourself used to what it'll feel like when you're in heels. I hope this video was helpful. Please leave a comment or a question. I'm here for you. We'll see you next video. Bye.